building a page with Kartra's Page Builder. In this video, I'm going to show you the basics of building any kind of web page using Kartra's amazingly simple page builder. You probably know Kartra is a comprehensive online platform where you know you can create web pages, marketing funnels, membership sites, host your email list with lots of analytics, got an affiliate marketing program and much, much more. Hi, my name is Sue Ferreira, founder of Wisdom to Wealth Mastery, where I show you how to take your wisdom to the world so you can create a much greater influence, impact and income using video and all the cutting edge tools of the web. So subscribe to my YouTube channel to learn more about how to get more clients by taking your message to the world. So click that subscribe button below and then click the little bell icon to get a message every time I upload a new video. Let's go over now to the back end of my Kartra and I will show you how to build a page with the Kartra page builder. Here we are in the back end of my Kartra and you can see we're already on my pages. I've got a few built already. I'm going to build a new page and I'm going to build one from scratch, but I'll show you the other ways you can do it too. And this is the default page you will see when you go to add a new page. We're going to use this one here, blank canvas. But one of the neat things about Kartra is you can save your own templates. Once you've got your own branding on a particular template, you can save them as I have done here. And if you don't want to start with a blank canvas, you have all these other options down here. Squeeze pages. Look at them all. Squeeze pages galore. Video sales pages. Thank you pages. Everything you could desire all the way down to upsell pages beautifully created templates that you can use. But as I said, today, build from scratch. So back to blank canvas and launch builder. Enter the name of the page, test. And I've got no particular category because this is a test page. And so we're just going to create it. And here we are on the basic build page. Before you start building a page in Kartra, Understand that there are sections, there are blocks, there are components, and there are columns. And it will always tell you down here which one of those options you can drag and drop into any section. Now, obviously here it says drag and drop a section here. Briefly tell you the difference between the column mode and the component mode. The column mode, think of that as the scaffolding of a building. Components, on the other hand, are what you would do in between the scaffolding that you've put up or the structure that you've put up of the building. So you might have a room inside with a window here and a window there. And then on another part of the scaffolding, you would have a door. The components are really doors and windows that fill in between the scaffolding. With your columns, you can either leave them invisible or you can show them as well. Now for this demonstration, I'm going to show them because it kind of makes things a little bit easier. So we are going to drag and drop a section here. So we go to sections because that's what it tells us to do. And when building out the page, why don't we put in a top menu? Because the chances are at some stage you're going to have a top menu. Now it's no point trying to click and drag just like this because the little arrow tells us we have a drop down menu here. And when we click the little down arrow, we have all these options for header menus. We can choose any one of these headers and click and drag it into this section. Every one of these headers can be customizable. So don't worry about the colors. Don't worry about the positions. It just makes it easier for you to begin with. So there we are. We have added a header and you can see there are little pinky purple lines around these two columns because they are columns and I've got it on show columns. If I click the columns off, they disappear, but it helps to give you an idea of what you're building on the page to be able to see them. And also, if you want to edit, you can edit within the color. It helps you knowing which column or which section you're editing. For example, here there's two little pink columns. And so I would, by clicking this pencil, I would just be editing this part of this block. If I come over here, I would just be editing this block. Now, if I came over here to the blue, you can see that underlying the pink, there's also a blue line, which means I would edit everything in between these two blocks combined. And I'm going to keep it now and say apply. 
Now I can't edit the logo at this stage. If I wanted to add my logo here, I can't edit the logo at this point because all I can do is edit this entire block. So, but if I came over to component mode, I can now edit my logo, go to the edit button. Um, I'll pick an image, pick my logo and confirm, apply. And now my logo will be up here. If you're clicking furiously and not getting any result, always check back and say, have I got a section? Have I got a component or am I in column mode? That will save you frustration when you first learn how to build a page in Kartra. Let's add a hero section. You know, the big section that goes right at the top. Let's see, this looks pretty good. Come in here and drop this hero section in here. And again, we can outline, we can see the columns that are there, but here is our hero section again. This will edit just this section. This will edit the two together. Let's say now I'd like to put in another empty section. Here is an empty block. I'll bring it down and drop it here. And now we have, it tells us to drag and drop a column. So if we come back and click components, we have column options here. Again, don't try and click it on its own. It won't work. Click the little arrow that goes down and up will come your different options for columns. You see, you have a lot of different arrangements. Suppose you wanted to put in a sidebar. Now I'm going to drag and drop here and you will see some orange bars come up that turn green when you get close to them. When they turn green, you can let go of your drag and drop click. In will come your new columns. We have a column that is 66% and 33%. So basically we built kind of a sidebar system here. Now it says drag and drop a component, not a column not a section. And we're in components, go to components and let's add a mock-up composition. Click and drag this component in here. It's orange, it turns green and it has appeared. Let's click and drag this one of New York into the other side. And there we are. We've now added a two thirds and a one third component into our columns here. If I want to bring this component down a little bit, I can click edit. I can put a margin at the top. I don't know how much I'll say 60, apply and down it comes. And then you can fiddle until you get it looking right. Now let's go back to sections and add another section. This time let's look at section content. We've got a lot of different options here for section content. Well, we're on the kind of iPad kick. Let's put in these iPads. And we now have another section. You will notice on the side, the little red edit cogs. It really helps because you can edit each section in here. It says section four for this. So you edit within section four. Here it will say section three, section two, and our header at the top will be section one. This is the move icon. So you can also click and drag and move these sections up and down. I have moved the large iPad and iPhone and put it below the four smaller ones in the four columns. Let's now look at adding a checkout form. And we have many checkout forms available. Click and drag. I'm going to do one more empty section, an empty block. I'm going to drop it there, components, and look at columns. And this time I think I'll take a 50-50, bring the 50-50, it's, it's green. And let's add some text in here. So we go to components, text, which I will pull into here and into here. Drag and drop a column. Let's put an opt-in form in this box. And there we go. The only thing we really don't have on this page now would be a footer, click footers have our footer options come up and bring it in and drop it there. In a very short while, we have built a totally customizable page within Kartra. Actions, save progress. Preview. Open preview. I want to translate this page. 
Now, it certainly isn't the prettiest page you've ever seen. It would require a lot more customization, but it's a page and it's easily done. Click and drag. Just remember columns, components and sections and away you go. If you like this video, which shows you how simple it is to build a web page, any kind of web page with Kartra, hit the like button below and leave a comment or a question and share the video with your friends because they may be interested in Kartra too. And be sure to subscribe to my channel and download my PDF, the only three tools under 20 bucks that you need to create client attracting video. The link is in the description below. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.